everyone, so today we are doing a very exciting video. In this video, we are going to be doing another big try-on haul from one brand. So today we are going to be trying a whole bunch of clothes from the brand Laura's Boutique. Now, I... I... I kind of stan. I've been following Laura's Boutique on Instagram for a very long time and I've always seen the clothes and thought they were super cute, but I never even put two and two together like Oh, a clothing brand. You should try it. I never put that together until a few of you guys have been commenting asking me to try Laura's Boutique and that's what triggered this video. So I don't know too much about Laura or her boutique. All I know is that the clothes are very cute. Her son is adorable. Her and her husband are goals and that is all. Uh, I'm really excited to see the quality of these items. They're not overpriced. They're not underpriced. They're right in the middle. So I'm really curious to see. So I have this big box. Actually, it's not big. It's small which makes me confused because I thought I ordered quite a bit but now seeing the box they either packaged it really tightly or I didn't order as much as I thought. See doesn't this box look small like usually in these videos I've got like a huge box or like two huge bags and I swear I got quite a bit of stuff so Laura if you package this you did good she got like so much in here. <coughs> Why did I think Laura's doing the packaging? Like Laura, the brand owner, is doing the packaging. I kind of doubt it. Even though it was a really small package, it did rack up a little bit of customs coming from the US all the way to Canada. It got, I think, $25 of customs, which is not too bad, but it is a good thing to keep in mind that the shipping costs may not cover the customs to where you live if you're outside of the US or even within. I can't say if it would cost more within or not. But okay, with all that aside, I'm really excited to dive in, so let's open up. All right, inside, everything's packaged up really cute. It's got Laura's boutique on here. So okay, the bag is hitting me in the face. The box is hitting me in the face. So I think first we're gonna start off with the first item that I knew I had to have. Now, I actually went to place this order a couple weeks, couple months ago, but whenever I would, the stuff I really wanted was sold out in my size, but she restocks a lot. So I was just like patiently waiting and this dress was one of the ones I was patiently waiting for. It's the Selena dress and it really looks just like the dress that Selena Gomez wore. So I think that she remade that style in different colors. So I got it in emerald green. Now I'm curious to see if there's tags on these so that I can figure out how much everything was because I don't remember how much I spent on each thing. So I'll put the ad in the corner or like over the screen so you guys know. But here is this dress. So pretty. It looks like a satiny feeling material and it's got kind of like a deep neckline zipper on the back and it's supposed to kind of like have a little bit structure to pucker out at the hips. I think it's so cute and honestly I appreciate the fact that it has adjustable straps because that is one thing that I feel like every dress should have is adjustable straps. So I really, really like the look of this, the feeling. It feels really good. It feels super thick, like it wouldn't, like you slip it on, it wouldn't break. So, okay, let's put this on. First item from Laura's Boutique. Let's see what we think. Oh my goodness. Okay, I am so happy with how this fits. Like, okay, if you can see, there's no gapping anywhere around my waist which is so rare okay i am hard to fit i am weird dimensions but this dress has like no give to it not stretchy at all and when i zipped up the zipper it fit perfectly so i am super happy with that i don't know how many people will have the same experience but i am super happy with how it fits me actually you know what i think it would fit a lot of people it came in lots of different sizes i think the neckline is very low i actually bought this with the idea of going to a charity event but i don't know if i would feel super comfortable with that but i do think it's so pretty i love that it's not like bodycon because it's kind of got this little poof to it it's almost like it overlays the fabric because it's got like this little, honestly, it reminds me of a mushroom. Love it. I love my mushroom dress. Granted, I have pretty long legs in comparison to my torso. It is very short. It doesn't go to my fingertips, but I do love it. And I think with heels and like maybe some tights, this would just look so good. I'm actually so happy to have this in my collection. So far, Laura's Boutique for sure gets a thumbs up from me. I know we've tried one item, 
but I'm literally in love with it. For some reason, I just thought it wouldn't fit me that amazingly. I mean, I don't look amazing, but the dress looks amazing, so. I love it. Now I actually can't even remember, firstly, how many items I bought, secondly, how much I spent on the website. I'm a shopaholic. <laughs> so I'm just going to open everything blindly. The next thing looks like a sweater. Okay, it looks like it's gonna be one of those like off the shoulder sweaters, but it's got like this hole in it. See, I feel like these, sorry also for the lighting if it's getting crazy bright and then crazy dark. That always happens whenever I wear black shirts and for some reason I don't learn my lesson and I just continue to wear black shirts in videos even though it washes me out. Here is this shirt. This will make a lot more sense once I put it on but the color is really nice. It's like a thin sweatery material and the tag says I think the name of the item which is actually pretty cool. It doesn't say like Laura's Boutique. It says Loretta on this one which I think is what this shirt was called. I'll correct myself in the editing if I'm wrong. All right, please ignore the fact that I'm styling this nice shirt with sweatpants. Uh, I forgot to bring in my black high-waisted pants I wear in every single one of these videos, so this is just gonna have to do. But okay, here is this shirt. It makes a lot more sense on. It's a deep V like wraparound sh shirt, and I really like it because I think the small would fit like lots of people. Like I think that this would easily fit my mom and like my friends and stuff like that because I did wrap it around and tie it whereas I think if it if you filled it out a little bit better you could just leave the loop right here which is what I think it was intended but since I'm kind of a twig I have to make things work but I really like the color I think the fabric is super comfortable and once again this with black high-waisted pants and like black booties and a nice bag that would be such a nice like going out look and also be comfortable so I really like this as well. I'm gonna give it another thumbs up. We'll see if we find something we don't like. All right, and then I got a pair of these cargo pants. These looked so good. Now, Laura models most of the items on her website, which is very, very hard to know what to buy because she has like a great body. Okay, these look so cool. I really hope that they're long enough for me and they're small enough on the waist. They feel so, so nice. And I'm actually going to Hawaii in December and I just feel like these with a crop top would be so cute. So let's put them on. Oh my gosh, you guys, another thing that fits. I am so surprised. This has no gapping around my waist. It fits me so well. These are so comfortable. For some reason, I've just been convinced that like pants like this will never fit me unless there's like a little bit stretch to them so I can buy them too small. But okay, here is what these look like. I love the fact that they have so many pockets. That is just honestly so handy. And I think people who usually wear pants with no pockets don't understand how nice it is to have a few extra pockets. So I suggest if you haven't had pants with lots of pockets recently to go out and get some pants with some pockets and experience having pockets because it is so nice. Another thumbs up to these. I really love these. For sure you can catch me wearing these all summer, all fall. Okay, love these. All right, and then we got a striped, I believe, shirt. Yes, okay, another one that is going to confuse me. Any of these like wraparound shirts just immediately look kind of confusing. Oh, okay, so they feed through a hole and then it's going to wrap around and then you tie it tighter. Okay. Honestly, a lot of these clothes feel like Brandy Melville fabric, just like super soft and stretchy, which I personally really love. Let me put it on. Okay, so this one was more of a basic wrap around, unlike that purple one we tried a little bit earlier. This one, it was more obvious to me that it was to be tied around on the corner so you could make it kind of fit you however you want it to. It fits me really well. The sleeves are long enough, which is great for my long-limbed self. I really like the stripes and the color it's pretty basic, but I really do like it. Maybe it doesn't look amazing with the cargo pants, but with like black high-waisted pants, booties, a nice purse, this would be really nice. It is super cropped though, so if you don't like cropped stuff, you probably won't like, like these styles of shirts. But yeah, I really don't mind cropped stuff. I really like wearing high-waisted stuff cropped pants. Next. This skirt is so adorable. 
oh my gosh it's one of those okay you guys have told me what this fabric is before but i don't remember but it's those stretchy i want to say accordion but i know that's not the name of the fabric but it feels like an accordion if an accordion was a skirt and i love those because like they fit so comfy because you bend down it gives a little you sit up it'll take you know what i mean so these are just like perfectly comfortable skirts and i got this with hawaii in mind as well it could also be a shirt but i don't think so i think it's a skirt i'm gonna put it on as a skirt anyway okay here is this accordion skirt on fits amazing so comfortable exactly what i was talking about with when skirts have this fabric or shirts or anything it just makes them a thousand percent more comfortable so i'm on board immediately this black and white pattern is also super cute because i think if you were wearing like a yellow tube top or something it would just be such a cute outfit together like this skirt literally might be my favorite piece for sure so far if you guys follow me on instagram you'll probably see when i'm in hawaii i'll be wearing this every other day all right then we got another striped shirt this color combo is so pretty oh this isn't just a shirt this is a dress okay so this is a cute little fun summery dress now i know what you're thinking why are you trying so many summer clothes in the winter i'm sorry it's just those are the clothes i gravitate towards more because they're more fun to me but I promise in the future there'll be more hauls with like winterish clothes. If you guys want to see more winter clothes, go to my Pretty Little Thing haul I did like a week or two ago. Lots of jackets in that one. But here is this dress. It's got gold little buttons all the way down the front. It's so soft and stretchy and this, these colors, I just love this kind of like dark teal. What would this be like a seafoam green i don't know but it's just so pretty i really hope this looks good on me everybody cross your fingers for me please please excuse my bra straps i wore a nude bra but no one is believing the illusion this dress is so comfortable definitely hugs every angle uh <laughs> Definitely feel like if I ate a really good meal, I wouldn't love this dress afterwards, but in the meantime, I love it. Super comfy, really soft, and it's actually kind of a nice bodycon because it's not really, really short. Because sometimes I feel like when something is so tight, I just don't want it to be super short as well. It just feels like it's not balancing very good. Whereas this one goes way past my fingertips so i feel like if i was to bend over i wouldn't be like flashing everyone behind me and also do these actually unbutton they don't but i love what they add to the dress i think i'm set for hawaii after this i actually didn't think i got this many bottoms but i think this is a pair of shorts now these looked really good on laura so i had to snatch them up they're these black high-waisted shorts i got them in a small they have the stitching on the side and also like a few holes and it's really distressed at the bottom which i really like and i actually have no black shorts like this where they're distressed so i'm just hoping they fit because pants jeans are a little bit iffy when i get them online just because i'm in odd shape but we'll give them a go. All right, I just pulled that dress up to be a shirt. Kind of looks cute as a shirt too, but that's not what we're talking about. These shorts, which I was very worried that they wouldn't fit, but they actually fit great. And I don't know what kind of fabric this is, but it looks like jean, but it's actually stretchy and like way more comfortable than jeans which i actually need to know what this fabric is because i need to get more pairs of jeans like this because one of the main reasons i don't wear jean shorts is because they're so uncomfortable but these ones actually feel like not bad at all they do cover a little bit of the boot but they show a little just a smidge oh and i forgot to say this is not sponsored laura doesn't know me she doesn't know i'm doing this video i bought all this with my own money and all the opinions are 100 percent my own that being said thumbs up to these all right we're not slowing down here is another shirt this is a stunning blouse okay when i saw this i really really wanted it it's so soft i did not expect it to be this soft i thought it would have some more structure to it but i really am happy that it's so comfy like when you buy something and expect it to not be super comfy and then it is that is a pleasant surprise super soft love the striping 
let's try them. I definitely thought this was going to be more like business casual type clothes, but it definitely feels very casual, just super soft, and it really falls on the body. This might not be for everybody, but I really think that I'm going to get a lot of wear out of these. I just like the way it looks to have a collar. I don't know. I think collars on girls look like, kind of cool. I don't know. All right. I like this. Next. Okay, these look like they're gonna be pants, but I don't know. I'm like surprised by these. Did I buy these? They are some leggings that have like a blue stripe down the side. I think this is a perfect example of me seeing it on the model and being like, that's so great. And then I buy it and then I get it and it's a pair of leggings and I don't love leggings on myself but okay i'm gonna give them a go they feel super super soft they're almost like they're not like lululemon legging feeling they're like softer feeling and probably more stretchy i'll try them it's kind of random that i bought those but okay so i don't know how to say it how do you how do you spell embarrassed i don't know what my deal is i just don't think I was made to wear like tight leggings. I just think it makes me look really unproportionate. So these are super soft though, and I'll probably give them to my mom. I think she'll like them, but I think for me personally, I just don't feel super comfortable in them, even though they're super comfy. No, thank you. All right, and the last product is something that is camo. I do not know what this is. Oh my gosh, it's a freaking adorable mini skirt i really like it love the camo i'm just so into like camo with a black tank top it's just really nice but okay i'll put it on that is the last piece hopefully it's good hopefully we end off on a good note all right so we were so close it's a little bit big but i actually think i could make this work i would just have to wear a belt which is no big deal it is a little bit big for me but not so much that it would like start bunching the fabric. I actually think it would work fine with a belt. Feels pretty light and airy. I quite like this. So yeah. All right, you guys, so that has been me trying a whole bunch of clothing from Laura's Boutique. I think all of the clothing was super, super cute and also looked like the pictures. And I think honestly, very much worth the money. I think the exchange rate is not the bomb, like when you're from Canada, like me. But I do think in US dollars, it's very reasonable. I also really, really love supporting girl bosses and I see Laura as a girl boss. So I definitely applaud her on making such a nice brand. Um, I'm really happy I got to try this stuff out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and to the people who are asking about Laura's Boutique, I hope this helps you guys out and helps you know kind of what to check out. And yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did and you want to see more, make sure to click the subscribe button and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!